Hello everyone and welcome back to Plague Inc. Evolve. Today we're going to try out the simian flu virus. Basically, the people who made Down Out of the Planet of the Apes um, collaborated with the developers of this game to create this official movie content from Down Out of the Planet of the Apes. Control intelligent apes whilst eradicating humanity within an artificial virus. So, that sounds good to me. Let's do it. We can insert, insert genes here, but they're all locked because I ain't got shit. <laughs> I only played that game one time, so uh, that ain't gonna help us. You know what? I'm gonna be super punny here, and I'm gonna call it Ape Fluenza. Ha! Ape Fluenza. Wait, did I spell that right? Okay, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna place our virus here in uh, Russia because why the hell not? We placed it in America before. Probably more effective. I'm not really sure, but uh, let's mess the Russians up today. Simian flu virus identified. Apefluenza is a genetically modified virus created in a Gensys lab. It has successfully increased intelligence in apes, but has not been tested on humans. Alright, let's find out what happens. Okay, so I've been told by people that the, the thing I should do is just increase transmission a hell of a lot and then release symptoms after. I tried to do both so that, uh, you know, some of the symptoms would also increase transmission, but we'll just go with just transmission this time. We'll see how that works. Okay, here we go. So now the lab is unveiling the groundbreaking new gene therapy drug for Alzheimer's. Human trials are expected as soon as ape testing in Russia is complete. So that, I think, that's what starts it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and make it easier to trans transfer through the blood. Now, what would be a great thing to do after that? Water? I think water is pretty good, but Russians like to drink vodka. I don't know if Russians actually drink any water. I think they just drink vodka. You know what? Vodka's made with water. I'm sure we'll be fine. And we got a new symptom. Neuro Enhancement 1. That's not good, is it? Virus able to enter brain cells and modify DNA. Improving existing neural pathways. Increases intelligence in humans. That, that might be okay, actually. I'm thinking that might be okay because... I don't know if that's going to cause any... Okay, no lethality and hardly any severity. I'm sure we'll be fine. Okay, so you guys know we're in Russia, which means we're going to need some cold resistance. So how about we evolve it to withstand cold temperatures and climates? Those freaking Russians are badass, man. I don't know how they live up there, because, like, look at that shit. That's even higher up than Canada. I live right over... Where the hell is Newfoundland? So the people apparently in northern Russia are getting affected the most. I don't know why. I don't know what's going up in nor going on in northern Russia. Maybe there's a lot of banging going on. Stuff like that. Who knows? Maybe they're drinking a lot of water. And now it's spread to Turkey. Turkey has been infected. Take that, you damn turkeys. And now we also have Kazakhstan. Oh, this is not good for Kazakhstan. What, uh, what is Borat going to do now? 53,000 people are infected. 63,000, 73,000, 83,000. We are taking over the world, ladies and gentlemen. We are taking over the world. Oh, 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 look, there's something on a boat. Canada! Canada's been affected. Fuck you, Canada. Alright, seriously, guys, I just need to point something out here. There's a massive freaking island that is supposedly right here, and they decided not to put it in the game. That is where I live, right here in Canada, on an island called Newfoundland. I just want to point that out because I didn't realize that Newfoundland is just not in the game. This is Labrador, big old chunk of land here, and Newfoundland is the same size, and it's not even there. Like, what the hell? I'm not pleased. I'm not pleased, developers. You better put that shit in the game for me. Okay, I didn't realize, but it actually costs DNA to devolve diseases, which isn't good because I don't want to have to cost DNA to get rid of stuff, but at the same time, it might be worth it so that people don't know that the disease is coming, okay? Look at this. Look at this here. Pimples. Pimples everywhere. Little yellow pimples that are going to turn red and they're going to explode and everyone's going to die. Okay, we need to get Madagascar again, remember? Madagascar is hard to get, at least it always used to be, because there's only one place for it to come in. So Madagascar, prepare your anus. We're gonna get we're gonna get inside of you. World. It's not been noticed. Good. Good that is good shit. Nothing's been locked down. Everything is good. No research going on. This is the world that's infected in yellow here. And we need to get the rest of them. United States, you're next. Look, 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 look at this. As soon as I exited the thing, United States got infected. I I can predict the future. I did not know I could predict the future. But I should have known that because if I could predict the future, I would have predicted that I would have found that out. Forget it. Come on, give me, give me some more DNA points here, guys. Come on. Hey, here we go. What was that? Who got infected then? No idea. We got a nice little building here, though, hey? Look at that. Look at that cute little building. It's huge. So we got a new minor disease spreading. It's called Apefluenza. Appears to be mostly harmless, but must be investigated further. Other countries are also reporting the disease. 
This is where shit gets crazy, guys. We need to get Madagascar infected before it's too late. Because I'm not letting them Madagascarians, or whatever the hell you call them, I'm not letting them survive while the rest of the world dies, okay? Uh-oh. Okay, so they revealed that as escape from their lab. That's not good, because then people are going to be shitting their pants. And now people are getting rashes. No, absolutely not. No rashes for you. I can't even get rid of it. I don't even have any, like, I don't have the points to get rid of that shit. I feel like this is not going to go well for me here. I mean, we got we got lots of stuff going around here, but no one else seems to be getting infected. Never mind. Look, look, it's popping up everywhere. Holy shit. Okay. <laughs> that was good. That, oh, 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 over here too. Anyone else? Here? Here? Here. There we go. And here. Now, now you know what that means. We gotta increase our heat transmission ability. What's this? Simian neurogenesis. Modify simian genes to significantly increase ape intelligence. Iris has turned green and no immune response triggered. It's time for apes to rise. I'm not ready for that yet. I'm not ready for that. Cure 25% complete. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Alright. It's not really a big deal yet, though. People are like, eh. It's, it's not really a thing. So, as long as people don't start shutting down all their shit. Okay, they fully sequence the genome. That that could help the cure efforts. That's not good. How can we get rid of the... How can we stop the cure a bit? We gotta, we gotta do something about that. 50% complete. Oh, crap. Okay. You infected? You're infected. Come on, someone infect Madagascar. Come on. Get the Africans infected right now. Alright, I don't know what else to do, guys, besides help to spread, so I'm just gonna help to spread here. I don't I don't know how to stop this whole thing from happening. Destroy Genesis Lab to prevent cure. Holy crap, wait, what? Pause, pause the game. Pause the game. That is really important. Oh shit. Shit, undo. Can we undo a move? Oh crap. Oh damn it. Wow. Great job, man. Not a big deal. We're going to do this all over again. And we're going to do it better this time. And we're going to let the apes escape before the cure is made, okay? That's what we got to do with our points. It makes perfect sense. I didn't realize that. And this time we're going to go with, um, um, down here. Where's that? South Africa. Let's do it in South Africa. Okay, so here's the thing. You see this here? Nausea. That is now one of our symptoms. There's a slight chance, slight chance of infection when kissing. I'm not going to devolve it this time because it costs money. We're just going to go ahead and we're going to pop in some heat resistance and we're just going to take it off from here. Oh shit. Okay, we got our <laughs> influenza spreading to Madagascar already. That's good because I always get scared about Madagascar. Welcome to the world, Madagascar. The world of influenza. Okay, we got a cure that's 30 something percent done. All we need is a few more DNA points and we'll be able to uh, stop it by breaking out of the ape thingy. Why is it? Oh crap. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We need these. How many do we need? One more? 17. We need three more. Come on. Three more. Before it's too late. Here we go. One more. And there we go. Now, we should be able to pop these apes out of here. Just, you know, pop them out. Oh, look at all this. Now we got more stuff. Holy crap. Okay. Destroy. Yeah, I know. We got to destroy the lab. Destroy the lab, apes. Why aren't you destroying the lab? Oh crap. Okay, they did a bad job of destroying the lab. Now they've escaped. Now we've got an ape escape. Now. Are people still gonna get- Oh, they're still getting cured. God damn it. Well, apparently, even though the disease has now been wiped out, I can still command these apes instead. So, the apes are able to plan and coordinate and travel together and shit like that. Let's do that. I don't know what to do here. I'm so confused. Just get the apes out of here. Fuck! We're, we're dead. Never mind. One more shot. We're gonna do our best. Here we go. Okay, we're gonna go central. We're gonna be a central location. How about Egypt? Okay, we're about to infect every single person in Egypt. That is good, that is very good, and now we need to do that with the entire freaking world, okay? And as soon as they start working on a cure, we're gonna pop in those apes, and we're gonna mess that shit up, hopefully. Okay, they're now working on a cure, we're gonna go in here, we're gonna go to our apes, it's time to release the apes. Shazam! Now, they'll break out of the lab, and that'll totally screw up the cure situation. I don't know if I did that too early or not, I hope I didn't. Hope that wasn't a wasn't a bad idea. Let's make the apes better. Let's make them let's make them have awareness. We also have to make the disease more infectious, but it seems to be doing a pretty damn good job. Apparently, you can get a Hamaday bridge, which allows the virus to efficiently jump between species. That's what we want. That's what we want. I think we need to do this first, and we need to do like these or something, and then we can get that. I'm not completely sure, but it looks like a great thing to have. Here we go. We got the bridge. We got the Hamaday bridgey thingy. Boom! Now, now we got this. Now we got it coming. And how about, how about we make it so that, uh, I don't know what the hell this is. 
Physical contact. Prolong physical contact and trigger transmission. Boom. Transmit that shit. Okay, now it's spreading between humans and apes. We should be able to uh, properly infect countries. Madagascar's down there. Shit in its pants because it's been infected. Yeah, take that, Madagascar. I've managed to infect Madagascar a lot, to be honest. I think now that people actually know the disease is here, um, it's not really a big deal if we increase some symptoms. But then again, they might start shutting shit down, so I don't know. But we got that bridge, so that's good. Bridges are good. How about we add in some more touching, huh? Touch, touch each other a bit more. There you go. So the people in Spain are like, oh shit, the disease is bad, but it doesn't matter because they've already been infected, so whatever. Canada, what do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing, like, trying to research and shit? Give that up. I'll kill you. If I could, which I can't, I don't think. Let's start throwing in some symptoms here, huh? Look, one point for joint pain. Five points for a headache. We need. We also need to increase infection. Ape to ape, all you gotta do is touch hands and you'll inf spread infection. That is perfect for the apes. And then we need to focus some more on the humans because I think the, the apes are good. I think the apes are doing okay. Look, what is that? A hemo... hemo... Hem the, the, that thing. Okay, look at this. The Gensis lab in Canada has run out of apes to experiment on, so the research team departed at dawn to set up a lab in a new country. I hope they die on the way. There they go. Look at them. Look at them go. Little bastards. South Africa is breaking down. That should help the uh, research. Yep. Research has been breaking down there. Come on. Oh, they're going to get that freaking thing complete. But what if they can't What if they can't administer it because of all like the closed places? They won't be able to send it around. Damn it. Don't deploy that shit. Don't you dare. I must start killing people. See, this is what I should have been doing here. I should have been working on the cure resistance that I wasn't doing that. And now it's too late. And I'm sad. <sighs> okay. That's it. Well, guys. I tried three times. I think it was three times to try and take over the world with apes. It is really hard. Especially since I haven't actually done the other one. So I don't have a whole lot of, uh, of extra things to help me with. Like, uh certain mutations and things you can unlock before you start the game but anyway that was a lot of fun i actually really enjoy this game if you guys uh, want to check out the game yourself and pick it up i'll have a link in the description thank you so much for watching and i will see you next time goodbye